People who live on Sullivan's Island concerned about an unidentified man seen cutting trees down in that island's maritime forest. News 2's Delilah James spoke to residents on how this is impacting them. The town of Sullivan's Island is working to identify a man accused of illegally cutting trees in a protected area. Officials on Sullivan's Island are hoping to crack down on the latest instance of something they say has been a problem for a while, illegal cutting on the island's maritime forest. Well, un unfortunately, we have seen that before, so this is not the first time that this has happened. Um, unfortunately, there are a small minority um, of people on the island who, who live uh, adjacent to this protected land, and they want ocean views and breezes from their house. The island's maritime forests play a crucial role in maintaining a healthy ecosystem and protecting nearby homes from high tides and storm surges. You know, it's, it's not just trees important to the community. This is a very special area. This is a successional maritime forest. It's a rare growth on the East Coast. This is where accreted land on the islands begin to develop into a forest. Now, Sullivan's Island police are hoping to identify the person responsible, and they need your help, saying to News 2 in part, the latest case that we posted about on Facebook involving illegal tree cutting in the accreted land is an active investigation. As such, we cannot comment further. We are, however, asking for the community's help identifying the person of interest. Anyone who has any information on the illegal tree cutting activity is asked to contact the Sullivan's Island Police Department immediately. Reporting on Sullivan's Island, I'm Delilah James. Count on two. Next.